What is up guys, PCHD here and today we're back with episode 3 of Trading 2 Man of the Match Torres. So you can see that we've not got many coins, 890 in the top left, top right hand corner. Diego from last episode sold, I think we picked that one up for about 40, between 35 and 40k, so still a nice 10k plus profit on him. Here we have three new different players, we've got this uh, Kumar Dozi who we paid 37,000 coins for, we're looking to sell him on for about 45 these three players were quite a pain to sell to be honest with you, it took a very very long time. This episode generally took a very long time for me to be able to sell them. We have this uh, left wing 85 rated Pedro and that was bought for 37 and um, a half thousand coins. And he originally on like checking the cheapest on the market was about 60-ish. Uh, I think the cheapest was about 60, so I listened to 58 but eventually he was just slowly going down and down and down. So he was another one that... I expected to make a lot more on, but in the end we only, we didn't make as much, but it's still not bad to be honest. The next one is Hamseek that we paid 34,500 and we him up for about 45,000 I think in the end. 44,000, so that's about 6,000 6, coins profit, something around that mark, so it's not too bad. All those players are expecting to make over about six or 7,000 coins on each. So, doesn't sound too bad from there, and guys, it would be great to try and smash 200 likes on this video. Um, that would be great to try and hit subscribe to me as well if you're not subscribed. But, you can see now in my, this is just my little watch list, um, the players I had there just show that's what I was keeping my eye on. Then we move on to see that three items have sold and we have 32,000 coins in the top right hand corner again. So, all three sold, you can see the Hamseek sold first time for that 44,000 coins. The Man of the Match player sold 42,000, it's still about four or 5,000 coins. And then the Pedro that we bought for 37 sold for 49, so again, could probably be about 10,000 coins for him. Then we got a Sanchez Inform, I think this is his first Inform that we bought for 46,250 coins and I'm not sure off the top of my head what we lift him up for but I think we make, it's not too bad profit, I think it's about 7 or 8k profit we make on him in the end. We see that we list him up for about 56, 57,000 coins we list him up for, so even then that would be about 9, 9k profit-ish after the tax on him. Higuain that we got in a central mid and he was, I think... By the time we end up selling him, we just about broke even on him because he was just so hard to get rid of. The next cheapest was 57k on the market and I was listening for at least a day yesterday. Just constantly relisting and eventually sold but it was like no profit made on him at all. This um, Busafra again bought 4.4k and we him up for 6 So that's not too bad guys, the, the different ranges of profit in there, some we made, maybe not the best. But we come back to see two have sold and um, 19,000 coins in the top corner. See that the Sanchez sold 57,000 coins. So that is, again, that's probably about the 9k profit. The Busafa sold, that was just your average 2k profit. And then we have three new, well, two new ones, and then still this Higuain that we're still trying to relist. We try again for 55,000, but again, like I said, he only goes for 50,000 in the end. We have a Zaha that we bought for 61,500, and I think. Uh, I think we list him for about 75 or I think it's about 75 or 77,000 coins. It could be less, I'm not sure. We list him for 77,000 coins, so that was about probably about 10 to 15,000 coins within that range, I think. And then there is also this central midfielder, Leitner, who we bought for 11,000 coins and we list him up for, I think we list him up for 18 and a half. Or it could be 19, and I think eventually sells for a little less than that, but it's still that 6 7k profit. So, guys, if you have enjoyed this, please do remember to drop a like, subscribe to me if you haven't already, and I'll see you uh, possibly on a later video today if you want, and this can go absolutely ham on likes. So, I shall see you all then, guys. Bye bye.